right, all right. How's everybody, how's everybody? Another episode of the Fitness Portfolio. Avengers, competitors, so forth and so forth. Trying to see what it's about. Actually, just gonna go around, you know, talk to some vendors, take some pictures, um, and see what I can do. What's up? Let's go chop it up. Let's go. Tell us a little bit about his business. Cool. So yeah, so we're, we work with Pure Therapeutic Ketones. So if you would eat a low carb diet, Atkins, Paleo, different versions, you could put your body into ketosis. Ketosis is a state where your body is metabolizing fat for fuel. Now that's very hard to get into. It takes days of nutrition or days of fasting to starve the glucose out of your body to create the ketones. We actually have the world's first the world's first patent pending technology that will put your body into ketosis in 30 minutes. So, so we have a scientific formula. I always like to compare it like in the 90s when Olympic athletes started using creatine, a lot of people thought they were crazy and you know like my body creates creatine, why do I need to add creatine in? Same thing we do. I can get into ketosis through diet, why do I need to drink ketones? It's gonna amplify your experience. I, I always tell people like, you can watch the Super Bowl on a black and white TV, or you can watch it on like a new fancy LED curved 4K ultra high def, have all the fancy gold plated connectors and the high definition package and all that stuff. It's the same game, same commercials, one's enhanced. So you're enhancing your experience, and then when you have those days where you fall out of ketosis because you ate some grapes, or you had some pineapple, or you were really dying for that piece of pizza, you can use ketones to bridge that gap and keep your blood ketone level elevated. That's the world's first push-up card game, six different types of push-ups, one deck, travel size, 54 cards, maximum mix, the muscle confusion is off the chain. We also got a music department, okay. a music okay. division, Iron Army Music. Okay. Uh, we have a live band, which is uh, actually one of the videos that you're seeing right now. It's one of our videos you know, right now. It's called This Is It. We play live all over the place and trying to bring that whole feel of uh, weightlifting and music right back here. Okay. Where it belongs, you know what I mean? Right at these shows and stuff like that. Right. A lot more entertaining. That's what we do. So, so where are you based out of? Uh, we based out of the Eastern Shore, Cambridge, Maryland. You know what I mean? We came down here. It's our first shot out. Okay. You know what I mean? Wanted to do something big and um, do something that made a little bit of a splash. You know what I mean? Enjoying okay. it. Okay. Okay. Love okay. being here. Okay. So um, this um, I just want to see like a deck of cards. So what like a new deck of cards actually look like? Yeah. yeah. No, I'll tell you. I can show you what it is. Give me that deck right there in front of you. It's that deck. We actually going to be running a little demo in a while, you know what I mean? Okay. This is the back deck. 54 cards right here. It's totally customizable. You got wide push-ups. You got diamond push-ups. You got negative push-up drops. You got regular ones. You got ladders. You know what I'm saying? All these cards are laced right in here. You shuffle them. The first card you pull is the number you got. Look, the train with train 50. So, you know, and then the cards that you can't do, you just simply take out of the deck until... You know what I mean? You can actually do them. You can actually run classes, pet deck classes, the pet deck classes all over the place, especially on the Easter Shore. Uh, we have them from 8 years old to 50 years old, to 58, knee replacements. You can do them off the wall. The hand positioning and not knowing where that comes from takes the muscle confusion to a whole different level. Okay, okay. And you have a coat line too. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay, okay. okay. So, um, for men and women? Men and women. Okay. It's all the way down. Soldiers on the side, and it's a total wide, you know what I mean? Total stringer. We got dry fits as well, 
my man Chuck Ball or Chuck Booker, you know what I mean, because that's what he does. You know, he balls and he books you. Silverback back here, man, in the table. Of course, over to the side, we have main man workouts, training with Trey. Andrew Money Jackson and Alec the Amazon Adams from <laughs> Wonder Woman Mentality. You know what I mean? Hashtag WW Mentality. We all in the building and all support. Absolutely. Absolutely. All right. How's everybody? I'm at another booth. I'm at the Gym Lunatics booth with Tammy right here. And um, Tammy's actually about to just tell you a little bit about the business and, you know, and the clothing line. So we're a fitness apparel company. We have fitness apparel for both men and women. We have everything from pretty much tank tops to sports, sports bras and bottoms. So pretty much your one-stop shop for everything. Now we do events at pretty much any event across the country. And all of our events can be found on our Instagram page, which is Jim Lunatics. And also, you can shop us online at jimlunatics.com. Okay, okay. Now, what's like what's the usual price range between maybe some tanks or what's, you know, or, you know, kind of like this, um, you just put out some prices. Yeah, sure. All of our tank tops are pretty much about $25. This is just one of our tank tops right here. Oh, really? Uh, everything is pretty much... In the more reasonable price range, our most expensive thing is probably some pants that we have that are $50. But we have sports bras that are $35, shorts that are $35. So. Okay, and, that's, uh, and is that for a man or a woman? Um, we have it both for men and women, but this is the women's style right here. Okay. This is one that we have for men, which is similar, but different size. Okay. Um, you see also like shorts and sports bras for the women. That's kind of awesome. All right. So this is some of our shorts. We will see you guys in nine weeks. We will see you guys in nine weeks. Now this is another one right here. Do you know one? Our other company Okay. 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 Now, are you rocking the gym? Um, in six brand, of course, of course. It's a crossover hoodie. You know, very airy, very light. You pretty much wear it anywhere. Okay. I'm here with another competitor. Um, and what's your name? Quincy. Quincy. Okay. And where you from, man? I'm from DC originally. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I live out here in Baltimore, though. Okay, okay. Yeah. Now, is this your first show? First show, yeah. Okay. First show, first competition. Oh, seven months ago, I decided I was going to, you know, knock it out. So, like, four months, I gained up, gained weight, and then um, three months, I cut down. Okay. It was nice. It was nice. And, you know, I love it. It's addictive. Okay, yeah. okay. So, um, I competed in the True Novice, Novice, and then Open Physique. Okay. So Physique is, you know, I'm sure you probably already know, it's more like the smooth, kind of aesthetic kind of look. Sure. Um, the biggest thing for me was learning was the posing. That was okay. that was rough. Okay. You know, okay. learning you know learning experience, learning curve for sure. Right. But right. Um, yeah, I think I got it. I think I did good. So we'll see see at four how I do. Okay. Yeah. See if I make it to the night show. Gotcha. gotcha. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now the question is, then a question that I have now. You said that you prep for this show in seven months. Mm -hmm. Seven months. Okay. And with this physique. What type of background or fitness background did you actually have before? Because I know you just didn't get this physique in seven months. Yeah, so I am a trainer, mm -hmm. um, but my results are actually exponentially different from where I was seven months ago. Um, I, I don't know. Like I, I've trained all my life. I played football, um, but something just told me that I wanted to get to that next level. And this was it, you know, this is the only way for me to do it. I had to create that competition, so that's what I did, yeah. But yeah, I definitely worked out all my life. Um, but what I started doing was, you know, when you get to this level, you have to be extremely strict with your diet, extremely diligent with exercise and working out. And even more than that, you're, um, you're creating that mind-to-muscle connection, you know. So, you know, I had to kind of relearn a lot of that stuff. Sure. And um, and get it done, yeah. So okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Now this is your first show. Now do you have any other shows planned after this? Yeah. So I'm thinking about doing the um, the Eastern Regional and um, on June 9th here in Baltimore. Okay. Yeah. So um, so I'll probably do that. I gotta take a little break, take a you know a week or two off, and then get back at it. So 
Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I got you. I yeah. got you. Okay. So basically, with this, your first show, you addicted. What is the ultimate goal for you? Is it the pro? Is it just to kind of stay at this level? Like, what is the goal for for, for you in the next, I say, one or two years? Well, my goal is self improvement always. Um, so going pro, you know, we'll we'll see. Um, right now, it's about learning and progression. Sure, sure. So the baby steps. So. I'll take that, you know, as it comes. But right now I'm work, working on a craft. This is my first kind of run around, you know, run through. So working on my posing, building up my physique even even better uh, the next time, and you know, and just going from there. So yeah, well, you know, if that comes, if pro level comes, then you know it comes. But if it doesn't, it doesn't. You know, my goal is self improvement always. You know, you can catch me on online to Instagram, live good, die good. Um, I do a lot of you know workouts online as well, so you know you check me out. So. Okay, mm -hmm. okay, and is that your Instagram too? Live good, die good. Yep, okay. that's right. Mm -hmm. Okay, and your name is Quasi. Yep, okay. Quasi. Yep. Okay, man. And yep. you from this? And you live in the Baltimore area now? The Baltimore area. Yeah, okay. from DC, but I live in the Baltimore area. Okay, mm -hmm. man. Good to know. Good to know. I appreciate your time, man. You too, man. Have a good one. You too. Appreciate it, man. All right. All right. I had the Chrome subs with. My name is Lauren Huddleston. I BB Bikini Pro. There you go, and um, she's just going to kind of explain a little bit about what she has at her table. So where you want to start? Okay, so let's start down here. We have our pre-workouts. We have Crush Intense. We have it in green apple and orange cream. Okay. Um, you can find it either here at the shows. We do do special pricing for the days here at the show. Um, or you can go to ChromeSubs.com. We actually have 10% off. Okay, now are these only two supplements? Or no. Or only, or, or only two flavors of the pre-workout? These are the only two okay. flavors currently, but we're always coming up with new flavors. Sure. Um, and new products. We also have our Chrome ads here. Um, and this is a roll on. I'm just going to this up. Okay. We have, you know, a roll on here. Okay. Put it on the ads for the workout. Um, we do a lot of products that you'll see online at ChromeSubs.com when you do go. Um, we're also featuring some of our apparel here. We have some ChromeSubs tape. We have a tape and t shirt. Um, you can see the one that I have on is a V neck. Um, and then we also do have an event. So those are just the two that we're actually um, promoting today. But we do have, you know, um, a magic pump. We have protein, um, a fat burner that'll be coming out eventually. And we have other products too. But you can um, view everything online at ChromeSubs.com. Okay, I appreciate it. Check out man, what's your Instagram? Your Instagram is the Workout Diva. There we go. I appreciate that. Thanks, man. All right, all right. Alright, come on there. So, you show me your record. Alright, we're gonna switch that up. Alright? So, basically, what you're gonna do is, you're gonna guide him. I made these long. Right? So, you're gonna put them on the wall. She's so gonna take your thumbs. Wait, wait, breeze. On the knees. And back to you. You're locked in. Always go in with your thumb. Okay. So, when was your thumb? You bring it back to you. Yeah, yeah. Bring it back to you. Okay. 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 The only thing you can do is go into the actual yeah, there's a lot of Yeah. I you to take a Okay, well, maybe, okay, well, maybe quick, you're doing it for the grand. Mark, right, bring it back on him, sir. Put it back on him. Put it back on him. Okay, you're good. Okay. So, the difference is, the difference is, when you grab the bar like this, all right, your fingertips are still in the equation, all right? But when you actually take the grips and you lock the bar in like this, it's all grip. Okay. It's all grip. This would be the same position you would be doing if you were doing pull ups, too. Okay.